how long should the talking stage be? Who should pay on the first date? Guys, this one's not in the car. Talking loud, talking loud, no, no. Before we start, you guys want to hear what we got? So the first question, how long should the talking stage be? I guess I'll go. I think, well for me personally, for me personally, if it's after a month, then, and you don't want me to be your girlfriend, just stop calling me. There's no <laughs> point. For me personally, for my, oh, um, it depends, like if I, I still like you. <laughs> um, she literally just <laughs> muted herself because she's on the phone. Okay. If I actually like you, then yeah, it, it should not take more than like three weeks to figure out if you want to be with me or not. So I think if I actually like you, then yeah, like what she said. But like, I talk to a lot of people, so I don't date people. But like, I talk to a lot of people, and I just feel like I just talk until I don't want to talk no more. That's what, I'm, that's what I do. I no, like, talk. no, yes. That's not a. Just, she's literally on the phone with somebody. She's been in the talking stage with I don't know how long. Months. Don't you know if you asked me yesterday? What did you say? I was like, I've never seen that boy. I'm sorry, guys. If you oh, see this, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just not ready to date you. Yeah. But I like you. Let's, all right. Who should pay on the first date? You can hop on it. If the girl asks you, wanna, if I, if I come up to you and you're a nigga, I'll be like, you wanna go on a date with me? <laughs> then I'm gonna pay for the date. But I'm not gonna do that. But a boy should pay for the first, like if it's an actual real date, like go to a restaurant or something. I think a boy should pay, but. Okay, what if y'all were just talking and y'all like both running up together, who should pay? Talking? No, like y'all are just talking to each other. Y'all like, like a conversation? Who should pay? If y'all actually go, who's pay? What? Let's say y'all just sit down with it. Nobody's like, oh, let me take you out. Another person, no, let me take you out. And then it's just like, oh, yeah, that's that place down cool. Let's go. Who, who's your pay? Yeah, like, it was a mutual thing. Like, nobody's trying to take the other person out. Who's your pay? Him. Or both. I mean. Or like, split I'm it? Not, yeah, I'm not. Like, if, if something like that happened to me, I'll probably be like, we could split it. But he should be like, no, I got it. But if he doesn't, I'll be like, damn, nigga, you broke. But... <laughs> Because, no, it's because every nigga I used to mess with, I used to have to always pay and spend my money for every single thing. Like, speaking on that, so, if y'all watched our last video, y'all know I do not mess with nobody. And, this is why I don't <laughs> like it. Like, she literally freaking peer pressured me into messing with this one dude. But we didn't mess with each other. We just talked or whatever. And then, we went to <laughs> But Renan did not peer pressure you. Yes, yeah, she did. He was on child, that, some childish stuff talking about some, somebody likes you. I'm not going to tell you who. Like, girl. No, and then she just, did after, 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 he, after, he, after he, no, after he told me he liked me, she was just like, just do it. Just do it. Like, you've never done this before. Just do it. So I'm just like, sure. So then I did it. And then later on, we went on, like, we went to the freaking, we went to Retzel's, this, it's <laughs> so stupid to say. Like, my family, like, they, they just tell us, like, even though a dude's supposed to pay, like, they always make sure, like, we got money on it. Like, we we can pay for our own stuff. So, this was a long time ago. But, you know, I was 13, went to the mall, and then he was, 13. he, I was. He Imagine. was like, he's like, what you want? And then I was like, you know, those cinnamon things. And then he was like, all right, I got you. He said, we can share. And then he, and then I was like, okay. And then he got got a freaking drink or something and then he goes to pay declined he sat there for minutes trying to pay like just kept getting declined and i was like oh no but i just paid for it like i just paid for everything but yeah this is the lesson for all you females don't go anywhere expecting anyone to pay for you are friends with benefits okay or like what is your thoughts on friends with benefits for me personally i'll never do it i feel like it, it depends on the people because if you can like if you and that person can do it without catching feelings so i feel like every time something do it one of the person that either the dude end up liking the girl and she's still over here about the dude or it's the other play or right around 
So as long as y'all can be mature about it and know y'all not, really not catching feelings, y'all not dating, this is just a hit it and quit it, but y'all still cool it, I think it's cool. What do you, what are your thoughts? I think that, um, like, if you can do it without catching feelings, then that's great, but like, if y'all were friends before and y'all just do whatever y'all do and y'all try to go back to friends, it's probably going to be weird, but like, it is not good for you, but I say... Don't do it in that situation because you're just going to lose your friendship for no reason, you know? And if it's like, I don't know, if y'all just became like, y'all do what y'all do. But basically, y'all just don't want to date each other. Ooh, good for you.